Hello dear friends, it's been a long time we didn't see each other. How are you? Happy holidays and New Year is coming. I really do not know what to... We haven't seen each other for a long time, but I do not know what... Uh, I can come up with some words. Anyway, let's just uh, keep it on, keep it going and see what will finally eventually come out. It's been a long time not seeing you. It's good to see you again. We will do um, a very simple, simple makeup. And it's holiday. You do not make it simple and easy. The, the thing I make makeup is that before and after there is no difference, so it's kind of disappointing. It's uh, not like a lot of other people, not even the artists. I'm not talking about the makeup artist, I'm talking about just the ordinary people. They can make a difference before and after, but uh, unfortunately I cannot reach to that level. Before and after is always the same. So, we went to skiing and it's good to get some uh, fresh air. Coolness, hardness, harsh weather, and uh, life will not be. I was, as we were skiing, I was thinking it's good we go out and uh, experience something different and uh, something we do not usually experience in a good weather, in an ordinary weather. We are in California, there are some rains, and that's the most. Still, it's not so cold, but uh, go to ski. It is a fun thing, but still it's not it's not that challenge to our condition, but still it depends on the people. Some people are more comfortable with cold weather. Then there I think there are people born for cold weather for snow and there are people born for hot weather. I like to be hot, to be warm. I like to be warm and I like to be hot actually. Not even warm, just hot. I like to be in the hot weather and uh, like sweating and uh, and uh, just hot 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 i enjoy it and uh, ski in the cold weather it's not uh, my thing but uh, from time to time change it's good for us to have a different experience in life so the best thing about this new year is I got a, a special little gift, a special little thing that is a, a tablet, That's, that is a drawing pad. A drawing pad where you can draw with a stylus and uh, draw I always wanted to learn something new and you know every 
December we had in my job there is a big project and after that big project I will be so much less pressured. I know life did not uh, stop after that big event but uh, it just much less pressure on it. I can have more time on my hand or just do not feel so stressed and so I was thinking of starting something new the other day in every time I went to see concert I wanted to play guitar I just feel that uh, the guitarist is one of the coolest guy and if the singer play guitar and sing and it's just the coolest the coolest of the coolest the coolest of the cools coolest coolestest coolestest of the coolest so I always want to play guitar and um, and oh, oh. and then because I never played guitar, so it's a little bit far from what I know, what I can. So I never really started. So it's. Something you want to do, but not realistic. Do you know what I, what I am trying to say? There are many things in our life we dream, but maybe those are the dreams that we will dream forever, for the rest of our life. And it will never, it will not be easy to, to realize because um, with... Uh, condition with everything is just not right but there are something that you can do that is closer to you that has a foundation from yourself and those kind of dreams those kind of desire is much more practical and much more doable so I got the tablet to do some drawing and uh, the first night I did one drawing I enjoyed it then I became a little bit addicted to it and uh, keep on draw and draw I enjoy it very much another good news my house is a little bit messy and I found my baby lips this one I have two baby lips one is a little bit more pinkish one is a little bit more orangish and uh, I found the pinkish one I'm very happy so so nothing serious nothing really Heavy, it just this smells cherry and uh, cherry ra raspberry. So it makes me happy to start something new, new year, new resolution, and I can start something that is not far away from it. And by learning new things. I find it is so fascinating this game, this toy, and uh, uh, pretty sure this um, those drawing softwares. It's Autodesk, uh, Sketchbook Pro. It's um, it's designed by real artists, so um, so you can build your knowledge from what you have. I think the best way of learning things is not totally start something all new. 
you may not succeed as successful as if you start something from what you have already know. Learning a new language, maybe it's not a good idea for a new year resolution, but improving a language or uh, learning a new trick totally different from your from your your from your expertise or from your ability you may end up uh, feel defeated and uh, end up not going very much far away and if you start something which you already have knowledge you build on that knowledge and transfer those knowledge into a new set new set, new concept, that will be more um, more resultful. So, because I, I, anyway, I did some drawing and painting, I have kind of ha have a, a feeling of brush and hands. And uh, trying this new software, maybe I should show you the painting of what I have done. Trying this new software and um, just to make you to understand more of the traditional way of drawing because it comes from the traditional way of drawing for example blending color you put in some color and blend with different color and um, it's uh, an extension of your existing knowledge so i i, I enjoy it and um, Let's talk about New Year resolution. Do not make yourself too much a goal. Do not give yourself a goal that you cannot realize. Do not dream about losing 30 pounds. Do not dream about those. Those put ourselves into too much pressure. And if you want to lose your weight, so much, so many people are talking about losing weight, and it seems going to gym and losing weight is is the only New Year resolution. There are many things you can do. You can feel accomplished. You can feel good about yourself. Do some small things. Smile a day, and uh, do one thing that makes you happy. If playing game makes you happy, make sure every day you play a few minutes of the game, but not getting too much of it. If your job is not a professional game player, do not spend too much time on, on it. And uh, have, uh, have a passion on something. Have a passion on get addicted to, to something. I always think that people need to be addicted and throw totally heart and soul into something to make something good. If you learn a new thing and uh, for example learn a new new game, you just play 10 minutes a day, 20 minutes a day, half an hour a day, you really never get into that intense feeling of it. And you draw until 4 o'clock, 5 o'clock in the morning and get into it and just figure out things, how it works, how you can improve it and crack things up. It's such a joy, it's such a, a, a feeling, the proud of accomplishments. And do something that makes you, that, that provides this kind of feeling make one burger that nobody can compete with you, just the right amount of juice, right amount of cheese, right amount of something and make it unique. Um, do a dance move that nobody can, 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 can beat you, nobody can imitate and nobody have ever thought about. And something different. You do not need to prove the world how good you are. You just need to prove yourself that uh, you made your effort and uh, you, you want to do something and you put your effort into it. Anyway, I am very happy for this new game. And uh, I want to be addicted to it. I want to not to sleep and do more of this game. 
And uh, another thing is about health. And uh, I think everybody need in our whole life, you need uh, a gazillion hours of sleep. Once you finish this sleep, you finish. And uh, in our life, there are this amount of happiness, this amount of things you, you need to do. It's already designated to you. When you finish them, you are done. You can make your life longer, you can make your life shorter. But the important thing is that you live every minute of your life to the fullest, to the no, re no regret, um, consuming every minute of your life. And um, do not compromise on this. I, I haven't been talking for a long time, so I'm pretty not good at talking. If you, if you endured until this moment, until this minute to watch this video, I thank you very much for your uh, for your company and uh, and uh, I appreciate your courage and your your tolerance and your patience to come to this end. And uh, I wish you, with my heart and soul, a very happy new year, a different new year, an approachable new year, approachable new resolution, approachable method, uh, a new spirit, just happy, right, good spirit. I want to talk to you so much, but I'm short of words, I'm short of uh, vocabulary. So, happy every day, enjoy every day, and uh, be silly every day. Bye bye, friends. I cut my own hair, so it's not so good. Maybe I will need to cut it a little bit more. But I do not want my hair drop onto onto my clothing. But I will do it in the evening. But anyway, it's not important. It's not myself looking at myself. Even if I look at my mirror, look at mirror, I will have a, a small percentage of the day that I look at the mirror. Most of the time is people looking at me, they suffer, I do not. Bye bye friends. Yeah.